Hey guys, so I realized that I didn't say good morning this morning. I'm sitting down to edit this vlog. And um, yeah, didn't say good morning, didn't say anything. It's day 16 of Vlogmas. And um, I worked in the studio this morning. Um, well, all day, open to close. And that's about it. This morning, I think I got a late start or something sick brain something like that that's what we're going to chalk it up to but the first clip you're going to see is lunchtime so welcome to day 16 of vlogmas okay successful trip to the post office Successful, really fast trip to the post office in the middle of the day. They got this post office thing down to a science. Me and the lady in front of me, she was like, oh wow, it's going so fast. I was like, I know, this is amazing. And... I think I was only in there um, the length of time it took to do like one and a half rows on this hat. I don't think you guys really have seen this hat for real for real. This is a hat for my little brother. Well, I have two little brothers. This is for the littlest brother who's not very little. His birthday was this past Saturday and I'm pretty sure he turned 25 and I have feelings about this. Ooh. And my other brother is 30? What is this life that I'm living? <laughs> no. He's 31. But yeah. Windshield wipers on. Randomly. Alright, so now I think I'm going to try well, I'm going to wait for all these people to pull out their parking spaces. Then I think I'm going to try to pop by Joanne's because I have no stitch markers. Probably couldn't hear that at all. I have no stitch markers, so I'm gonna try to get some. Do you see me? Do you see me? Do Bruh. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to pull out of this parking space. I'm halfway out this parking space and this guy is like not, not giving me the space to pull out of my parking space because he wants to park in another space right now. It's fine, it's fine. I got out of the space, he got in the other space without incident. But yeah, I'm gonna see if I can run in and out of Joanne's. I'm feeling a little bit better. My throat is still sore. My throat is still sore. Um, but I don't have as many body aches as I was having yesterday. So that's good. Especially since it's a very a super, super busy day. And um, everybody is dealing with the Christmas burnout. Like everybody. <laughs> and especially those of us who are regularly in the camera room, like the burnout is real. So I always feel bad whenever I'm like sick or not feeling well or anything like that because I know that I'm not pulling as much of the weight as I could. And whenever I'm not, you know, pulling as much of the weight, I know that that weight is being pulled by somebody else, you know? And I don't want to make anybody else's load heavier. So I'm glad that today, even though I am still feeling sick, I'm, I'm better than yesterday. So I can, I can hustle more, more today. But I have been, um, as you saw at the end of yesterday's vlog, I have been drinking my um, tea with golden seal echinacea drops in it. And Golden Seal <laughs> tastes terrible. 
but what I have discovered is um, when you mix it with ginger tea, that ginger pretty much punches that echinacea and golden seal in the face and you can't taste it. So I have a big container of golden seal echinacea tea, um, or no, I have a big container of ginger tea with lots of golden seal echinacea in it and that's what I have been sipping on all day. The ginger is good for my throat. The golden seal echinacea is good for this trash immune system that I have. <laughs> And, um, yeah. Or I could get these. It's the same price. You get more of them in here, and these are cuter. Well, I'm gonna get these instead. Get, give it to me. So, I'm sitting here doing the decreases on this hat, and I put in my new little stitch markers, which are really cute. Um, and I must have added in more stitches because the I have extra stitches after I finish. Either that or I can't count. Most, More than likely, I just added in extra stitches and now I have to tink back the whole row of decreases I just did. Figure out how many I'm supposed to be, figure, figure out what my decrease numbers are and stuff and then start over again. That's a little bit annoying. <sighs> Blah. Time for tinking. Hi guys, so I am in the Goodwill and um, doing some decompression shopping. <laughs> um, I got this nice blouse, a sweater, which Every knitter and crocheter needs to buy a sweater, right? A nice white shirt, which has no stains on it. Pretty dope. And this shirt with an astronaut on it. I'm kind of iffy about this one. I may not get it. But, yeah. I'm just poking around, seeing what there is to see. Um, it was kind of a long day at work. But, um, it is what it is. Back at it tomorrow morning. Ooh, yeah. What is that, 60s, 70s? Whatever that decade is they called. They need their shirt back. So this morning I packed my advent count my advent calendars with all intention of opening them during lunchtime. Obviously that didn't happen. So these traveled all the way to the mall and back. So let's open them, shall we? So we've got the wishes advent first. And this one is from Harbor Stitches. Ooh, that's a cool color. This one kind of reminds me of cotton candy. And then the Gundervent. And they kind of match each other again. This is so cool. Oh, but this little nugget is coming loose. Ooh. Just tuck that in. Look at that. 
This one is more green. This one is more blue. But they both kind of have a cotton candy, minty dessert kind of feel. And a dairy milk and a Maltesers. I think these are my favorites. I think the Maltesers truffles are my favorites. Um, that being said, I think there's only gonna there's only two, including this one. There's only two in the jar because I keep eating them. Oops, not sorry. I also got a couple other things at the Goodwill. I showed you the shirts that I got, and then in the jewelry or at the jewelry counter, there were some charms. I like looking at um, Goodwill jewelry, jewelry for charms to make progress keepers out of. So I found these. This was a dollar ninety nine. That's better. Now you can actually see them. These were $1.99, little jeweled Christmas trees. So I'll be making those into progress keepers. This one was 99 cents, and these are hearts. And they have split rings on them, but I'm gonna replace that with just a regular jump ring. And then this one was also 99 cents, and they're little presents. I think those are adorable. And if I actually wore earrings, <laughs> I, might, I might be convinced to wear these. Well, of course, after cleaning the, the ear wires. Who knows, maybe I'll wear these on Christmas. Probably not, <laughs> we'll see. But yeah, I got those. There was also a snowman brooch that I almost got, but um, then I decided not to because Florida. I also got one other thing and it was 99 cents and I just, I, look it's a tiny little Christmas tree. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I felt, it felt Susie to me. Like, like this is a Dr. Seuss tree. Like this needs to be sitting with all of my Grinches over there just to like, like fill it out, right? Like. I like it. It's adorable. And it was only 99 cents. And yeah, that's all I got. That's it, so cute and little. I like it a lot. And I like the vintage style that it has. And it's in really, really good condition. Um, there's only one chip right there. Um, on the, the tree part. The base of it is pretty chipped up. Like the paint is pretty chipped up, but I can, if if I'm bothered enough, I could paint it. I'm not bothered enough. But um, I just thought it was really sweet.
hat's done. It fits over my locks, which are a lot more fluffy than my brother's. And not too bad. And I don't really look like a mushroom. I might make myself one of these. I don't know why I'm telling lies. I'm not going to make myself one of these. <laughs> but yeah. All done.